Now more than ever, it seems we can't live without plastic. Plastic is everywhere. But plastic trash, too, is everywhere. It is estimated that over 300 million tons of plastic waste is produced each year, and over 8 million tons of that end up in our oceans. Plastic takes hundreds of years to decompose, meaning that it will continue to pollute our planet for generations to come. Reducing plastic use is ideal but challenging too. Proper recycling is the only effective way to prevent new plastic waste. In today's video we will see how the East Asian countries are recycling their plastic wastage. It starts with the waste pickers. They collect valuable things as bottles, glass, metals etc. from the waste. These items are then sorted according to their respective materials. Plastic recycling companies often purchase plastic waste from these waste pickers. Bottles are the most common item they prefer. To prepare the bottles for recycling, workers, usually women, sort them by color while removing their labels and caps. This task is tiring, as they work 10 hours a day for only $2. However, even the labels, caps, and other parts of the bottles are not considered useless as they can be repurposed to make new items. Once the bottles have been sorted, they are taken to a large press machine to be transformed into plastic blocks. Thousands of bottles are carefully placed in the machine. The resulting blocks are hardened and tied together using ropes to ensure that the bottles cannot come apart. Each block typically weighs around 250 kilograms. Finally, these plastic blocks are sent to other factories equipped with shredding machines that can turn the bottles into small plastic chips. From there, the chips can be used to make plastic granules. To wash the bottles, workers create a solution using water and detergent powder. They then group the bottles by color and feed them into a shredding machine, where they are washed using the detergent water. The resulting chips are shiny and small, but still contain some dirt that settles at the bottom. This dirt is removed by hand using a sieve. The chips are then washed in fresh water to remove any remaining dirt.
After washing, the chips are spread out in open fields to dry in the sun. Workers must frequently stir the chips to ensure they dry evenly. Once dry, the chips are melted in a large machine, producing molten plastic that is extruded in the form of thin wires. These wires are then immediately passed through water and into a cutting machine that transforms them into tiny plastic granules. These granules are then used to create various types of plastic products by applying heat and pressure to a mold, until the plastic takes on the desired shape. Faulty products are not wasted, but instead melted down to create new granules for future use. The finished products are then sent to a packaging unit and distributed to stores throughout the country. By recycling discarded plastic materials in this way, we can help reduce the amount of plastic waste that ends up in our oceans, 